All right, so the first thing we need to do is uh, unlock the uh, bootloader. And so uh, you can see I have my uh, Urbane hooked up here with ADB control running. Um, and uh, ADB control is just really great. I've, I do a video just on, on this, uh, and I recommend that you take a watch, uh, look at it, and um, maybe uh, you know consider using it yourself. Super handy tool. So um, one of the things that though we're going to have to stop this so we can actually do what we need to do, and unfortunately that part won't be displayed on the screen. But uh, so if we close ADB control and we say ADB reboot, and we want to go to the boot loader. So the watch right now is rebooting. It went to the um, to fast boot menu and it says you know what do you want to do fast boot mode uh, product name bass uh, and that it is uh, the bass 4 gig variant uh, hardware version rev 10 and uh, in fact I'll just maybe I can take a picture of that for later let's see here that a little bit. See if I can get a picture of this to throw up on here as well. Probably have to link that in the description or something like that, but uh, we'll, uh, we'll see what we can do. So, now I need to fast boot devices and see if it's still there, and it is. So then I'm going to fast boot uh, OEM unlock. And now it is uh, saying unlock bootloader. If you unlock the bootloader, you will be able to install custom operating system software on the phone to prevent unauthorized access to your personal data unlocking the bootloader will also delete all personal data from your phone a factory data reset uh, and then the options are no do not unlock and restart or yes unlock and void warranty so I'm gonna go with yes I hit the yes button and it says lock state unlocked and it says erasing 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 and then it says it's done. So that's uh, that's good. And uh, so now that we have that unlocked, we also, if we go to our downloads, we'll see that I have the Team Win Recovery Project sitting here. So fast boot devices, make sure they're still linked up. Fast boot flash recovery with this twerp right here. So it says now on the phone it says writing in green letters. And then it says it's uh then the writing went away and it looks like it's done. So now I will need to restart the phone and I believe let's see if there's any Oh, there's an option just to go to recovery mode from the phone. So I scroll through to that and hit enter. Now on my LG uh, screen, as the watch is booting up, it has a um, unlock icon on there. And a very, very, very tiny Team Win Recovery project. That's really funny. Okay, I'm going to allow modifications. And uh, let's uh, see if we can bring this up, ADB devices, and there's our recovery right there. Um, I don't know if, uh, let's, let's give it a try, CD, uh, CD um, documents, scripts, ADB control, Java, jar, ADB control, dot jar. I'm not sure if this will come up or not in here, because um, I don't think the screenshot tool works the same in Team Win Recovery Project as it does uh, 
outside and no it's not updating so it just has the old control I'm sure I can click on the screen but uh, that's that's not gonna help so um, we do have a very very uh, very tiny ADB screen which is really awesome I'm gonna take a picture of that as well and see if we can't get that on there for you alright so I'm going to pause the video for a second bring up those uh, pictures that I just took so that way you can see them here in the video before we continue alright so the picture turned out a little bit blurry I apologize for that <coughs> But this was a picture of the fast boot mode. I did want to point out if you push the little arrow, then it would scroll through options up here at the top. Not down the list, but up the top that would change to something else. And back would go back to the previous one. And then you could hit this, uh, the round circle would be like the enter button. And then uh, here we have our Team Win Recovery Project, and it's itty bitty tiny screen. It's really awesome. Um, you know, I definitely want to give props to uh, the the people who put that together. We'll be looking at that in more detail when we go to build it for ourselves, and we'll definitely be recognizing the developer who um, put this together the first time because I want to make sure to give them the credit and give credit where credit is due. So that uh, that's how we OEM unlocked our smartwatch, and that's how we <coughs> put the... Uh, put the uh, um, Team Win Recovery Project on there. And I just downloaded that straight from Team Win Recovery Project's website. Uh, most of you probably are not wondering, but this is not the uh, stock band. It came with a leather band, um, and I, I didn't like it. So I had an old watch that, uh, that was broken that had this uh, kind of beefier metal band, so I put that on because I like a, a good metal band. But anyways, uh, now you're probably wondering why I even mentioned it, but I I, I kind of like it. So anyways, uh, there we have the Urbane with our Team Win Recovery Project on there. I'm going to do some backups. Uh, it's always a good idea to back up everything you've got before you start playing with it. So that way you can always go back to where you were. So keep that in mind, and uh, hopefully this uh, video was useful for you too.